Hello everyone. Welcome once again to Aviation Maths classes. Today we shall have a look at another navigation mathematical problem. Question 3 in the BNC series. The question states that given waypoint 1 which is 60 degrees south and 30 degrees west longitude 60 degrees south latitude, 30 degrees west longitude and waypoint 2, 60 degrees south latitude and 20 degrees west longitude. What will be the approximate latitude shown on the display unit of an inertial navigation system at longitude 25 degrees west? The options given are as indicated. Now let us look at this diagram to understand the question better. Point A is as shown 60 degrees south latitude and 30 degrees west longitude. Point B is at 60 degrees south latitude and 20 degrees west longitude. Point uh, the line A D E is the great circle line and this is what the inertial nav would be following. Line ADE is what the inertial nav system is going to follow, the great circle line. Line which is shown in blue that is AEB or BEA is the rum line and it is once again a latitude line. C is the south pole which is 90 degrees south. So, the distance between AC and BC is each going to be travel of 30 degrees. And similarly, CE is going to be 30 degrees. In this question, what we have to find is, what is the distance between D and E? And this will be converted to minutes and this is what will be shown on the inertial nav window. So to calculate this we know this is 30 degrees BC, 30 degrees will be in nautical miles equal to 30 degree into 60 is equal to 1800 nautical miles. Similarly AC will also be equal to 1800 nautical miles. and line CE is also going to be equal to 1800 nautical miles. This I am talking about CE. What we have to find is distance of DC. How much is DC going to be? So to find distance of CD or DC we will have to use trigonometry and we will have to consider triangle B C D this triangle B C D. Now we know this angle A C B is equal to 10 degrees. So half of this considering this triangle half of this that is B C D is going to be 5 degrees. Now what we know is cos 5 is equal to adjacent that is CD upon hypotenuse which is BC. So CD is equal to cos 5 degrees into BC cos 5 into 1800 will be equal to this figure equals to 1793.15 nautical mile. So this we have got DC is equal to 1793.15 nautical mile. We have CE equal to 1800 nautical mile. So to find DE we subtract 
1793.1 frame from 1800 and we get a figure of 6.85 nautical mile. Now this 6.85 nautical mile will translate to 6.85 minutes. So this is 60 degrees. So this will point D will be 60 degrees 6.85 minutes. Therefore, the great circle that is the INS latitude at 25 degrees west that will be shown will be 6.85 minutes south of 60 degrees south will be therefore 60 degrees 6.85 minutes south 60 degrees 6.85 minutes. Therefore, the correct option for this question would be option D, which is closest. This is the closest correct option, which will be 60 degrees 06 minutes south. Happy landings.